All right, welcome back, everyone. We're here playing more Conrad Stevenson's Paranormal PI, and I know on the last video I had said that the last one was going to be, you know, the final one where we investigate ghosts, but I am happy to be proven wrong. Um, the developer went ahead and added another ghost onto the lighthouse map. If what the reports are to be believed, I mean, it's not an official thing from the developer um, that I can tell, but there's like going to be three more ghosts added to the game uh, in addition to the one that was just added. So there's more to look forward to there. Um, so I I'm going to go ahead and get to the new ghost in this video. You know, if you're not yet subscribed to the channel, please do so. Like the video if you like it or uh, leave comments below if you want to provide feedback. But that said, let's go ahead and jump right into the game. All right, here we are. Ooh. Nice. Is this licensed? Am I going to get YouTubed for this? All right, we got to get away from that. Hopefully, <laughs> hopefully YouTube doesn't... Uh... You know, doesn't copyright strike us for that. Um, all right, let's uh, let's go ahead and click on this thing here. We're gonna go ahead and check out the notes for the new ghost. I, I hope that they're in the wiki. Um, I don't believe that I have any uh, of the archive evidence for for it. So let's go ahead and see if there was anything added here. Novak Keepers, Coast Gary, Lipstick Killer. Okay, the Lipstick Killer now has some entries here that you can click on. I don't believe that was there before. We've already kind of read this before, so I'm not going to really go bother going over it again. Apparently there was a serial killer here, and uh, his name was Aaron Lehman. And now uh, it looks like the lawyers were saying that he was hearing voices in his head, so maybe Aaron was possessed. Ritual murders in the cave along the coast. Although I don't believe any, it mentioned in here, uh, you know, the cave. But that's totally fine. Um, so it looks like we got two new notes, which is great. Um, archives. Let's see if they... Yeah, so there's another a couple archive pieces here, which we're probably going to want to collect. Maybe we'll get them back out and then go back in once we um, once we do that. Let's see if they add anything to the email here. No, doesn't look like it. OK, so it's going to be these two along with uh, probably some archive pieces that we don't have. So let's go ahead and check it out. Let's jump right into the lighthouse map here. So there's a cave along the coast. I actually didn't even know there was a cave here. I don't know if that was added or if it was always kind of there. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm just going to bring just the temp gun and the EMF for now. Um, just because uh, we don't really know, uh, where the archive pieces are. So, I don't know where the, the, the cave would be along the coast. So we're going to go ahead and explore a little bit. I it might be on the other side of this island entirely, which, that's probably true. Let's go, let's go to over by where the lighthouse is. Maybe there's a way down. That we can go find a cave. Because that side seems to be pretty uncoast like. So let's check out over here. Okay, so we're here. We're, we're at what looks to be like a coast, the rocky alcoves. Let's see if we can find a staircase down. Hmm. 
Not so far. Um. Hmm. Let's head this way. Maybe the cave isn't down by the waterline. Maybe it's actually up here in the trees. Is this a cave? Okay, no cave so far. We're in the the uh, slave housing area here. Maybe it is by the barn because the lipstick killer uh, wiki entry did show a picture of the barn, and I always thought it was weird because there there was nothing going on with the barn in reference to the lipstick killer. So, uh, yeah, maybe maybe that's it. We'll just do a quick pass over here just to say that we went all the way around. There is an invisible wall right here that it won't let me pass. So it's clearly not going to be there. Another invisible wall. It will let me go over here though, so there's that. Nope, nope, there's a wall here too. Okay. Uh, this is that building that has no... Or at least used to have no way to get in. We can try. We can check to see if it opens now. I don't think it does, but we'll, we'll give it a shot, just to say we get, we tried. Yeah, it's totally locked. Okay. Okay, we have the creepy playground. All right. Do we have a cave over here? This looks promising. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. We can go down. Jesus, scared the crap out of me. Okay, so... That's loud. That's really loud. Okay. All right, we are inside of a cave, it seems. I'm wondering if, I mean, it, I might need to turn the audio down a little bit. Oh, here we go. Oh, that looks like a demon summoning scroll, just like we had in, uh, in the woods. All right, do we have any other archive pieces here? Let's start over from the beginning. Do a quick walk around here. That is not something you can pick up. What's all this then? Looks like bones. Yeah, bones of some sort. A couple different bone piles. Looks like something's been eaten in here. 
What is it eating, though? What kind of bones are these? So that looks like almost like a spine right there. Uh, some kind of job. Maybe it's like fish. Oh, we got some blankets out here. Just in case the ghost gets cold. So we're looking at a demon, it seems, based on the scroll that we found um, and the wiki entries, which talked about being possessed. Is this? That is nothing. Nothing but a rock. Okay. So it's not on the outskirts of the cave, as far as we've seen. Let's try going through the middle. Let's double check these rocks, make sure there wasn't anything on top that we missed. to say that finding the archive pieces is one of the more challenging parts of this game besides the RNG of the ghosts but like everything kind of just is that just what is that is that just a graphical artifact okay yeah a reflection of of something okay well I mean I don't see any other archive pieces, but again, everything kind of blends in together, which is not ideal when you're looking for things. We did find one, one archive piece, which is good. I think we were missing one from before the demon was added or whatever this ghost is I'm, I'm pretty sure it's demon um so i don't i think i don't think we're gonna i think we need to find one more unless i was missing two before and i just didn't remember correctly like there's so many things in here that could potentially be pieces of paper just because they all kind of are similar looking in tone I miss the days where it was like highlighted for you to just tell you when something was there I mean I might as well be Getting temperature readings while I'm just walking around, right? Looking for stuff. I Maybe it could be on a wall. I, I wasn't looking at the walls themselves, I guess. Not ideal. I wonder if the archive pieces could be on the walk up to the cave rather than the cave itself. Alright, well, we'll go check up the walk-up. Just, you know, fair warning. Apparently the, uh... The waves are very, very loud, so... Careful. There 
it is. Super duper loud. Oh, we got the water filling up the area. Nice. It's a nice touch. It's got to be unpleasantly cold every time that hits you. I don't... I mean, I don't see it. Maybe up here? Oh, I'm stuck. Okay. Oh, yeah, I don't... I don't know. I don't know exactly where they can be either. Like, can it be in the barn? I would assume not. I, I would think it'd probably be around here somewhere. Oh my god. My eardrums. Alright, that's enough. That's enough waves. Is that a cold spot? Yeah, I just don't know. Maybe we just go back with the one we do have and try to do the investigation that way. Oh, there's definitely a cold spot here. Negative. It's freezing. Hmm, these temp readings are unusual. Something is going on here. These temperature readings are definitely paranormal. I agree. I would have thought that like maybe there'd be like a archive piece over here with these blankets, because that seems pretty weird to have blankets here. Or whatever fabric that is just laying around. Yeah, if I don't find it in another pass, I'm just going to go back and use the archive piece that I do have to try to get a better chance of getting a full investigation. I'm just not... It's not standing out enough to me to for me to grab it. Alright, yeah. Let's, uh, go, I guess. It's so yellow. What are all these yellow spots? Is it just, like, algae or whatever? Let's get out of here. We'll go back and we'll do the thing. Um, we'll go, we'll, we'll, and then we'll come back and we'll bring all of our equipment down here. How far are we away from the our truck? Kind of far, right? Yeah, pretty far. Okay, um, yeah. All the animals, every time. Okay, here we go.
let's uh let's head to our office. Alright, archive evidence uh lighthouse. There we go. Evidence of demonic summoning. Okay, and then we will go to the wiki. Head down to the lipstick killer area. We got three. Not ideal, but hey, you know, we're so close to being able to actually afford the uh, auto cam. Do the smudges cost money? They do. 25 each. Oh, man. We're going to have to... Uh, we're never going to be able to afford the camera. <laughs> I mean, I guess we could grind out missions, but I don't really want to do that. And I feel like the best thing about... I mean, I you know, it could be that due to the randomness of the ghosts, it you know, maybe it'll be a different type of investigation each time, but I feel like like once you get the experience of each ghost, like you don't really need to necessarily do it again. But that's just my personal opinion, obviously. Okay. All right, let's go back down to the cave with all of our stuff. See if we can't catch ourselves a glimpse of the demon slash ghost. I am a little worried about the demon's ability to uh, charge at you and then take away your your evidence. Um, I haven't had to deal with that yet because I had kind of done the demon, um, all the demons before before uh, the new update dropped that gave them the ability to make you forget things and outright attack you. I'll keep, try to keep an eye out too for any additional archive pieces that might be around, but I don't know. It seems pretty hard to find some of these things, you know. Water puddles are getting weird reflections off of stuff.
feel like this is a good spot to get cold temps. Hmm, these temp readings are unusual. And it doesn't move either. Not at least not a lot. This is the most I've ever had. Something it. is going on. Just kind of stay these still. These temperature readings are definitely paranormal. See if we can't get some EMF off of this thing. weird reflection there is like super trippy to see out of the corner of your eye it makes it seem like something's moving keep thinking some of these these bone pieces look like the shape of the missing archive piece that I'm looking for so it's like tripping me out I'm paying a lot of attention to it when it's nothing to look at I guess I could try talking to it. Let's give it a shot. See if it'll do EVPs. Is there anyone here who would like to speak with me? Is there anyone here who would like to speak with me? Is there anything you'd like to tell me? Is there anything you'd like to tell me? Can you tell me your name? Tell me your name, demon. Can you tell me your name? All right, perhaps not. Oh, no, 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 no. How rare to take a photo of a ghost. I need to not. What does that sound?
What is happening? What's happening? Oh no! Oh no! As if I was sprinting instead of hustling, this wouldn't have happened. Photographs taken during this investigation are not convincing enough to share as evidence. Is that what it does? It makes it so that the... You have to retake the photo. And I guess it just did look just like a person, you know? Maybe I need to get it in its demon form, but then it's like so fast. I'm gonna keep my sprint on. That was really creepy. I didn't know it would change forms like that. Do you see like what it turned into? It was like some weird like sea creature monstrosity. There we go. Where'd it go? This way? Yeah. This way? This way? Back this way? Which way did we go? This way? No. Did it just disappear? Look like a like a siren or something. Even like dressed up in robes and stuff. It was pretty cool ghost model. Blanky for it. Wanna give me EMF here? That'd be pretty helpful. Oh god. Oh no no no. Incredible. I captured a ghost on film. I'm running, I'm running, I'm running, I'm running, I'm running, I'm running. 
How far does it chase? Wow, I, I took a photo of a ghost. Okay, our photos worked. Now we just gotta get audio. It's probably lots of audio. And uh, I would love to get EMF so that we get all the experience for it. EMF might also help with uh, getting the audio. These lights are acting funny. I should continue investigating. Where did it go? It's coming back this way? Yeah. Okay. Where are we going? This way? No, back this way? Can you make up your mind, please? Where do you want to go? This way. The EMF meter should not behave this way. This is paranormal. Looks like the batteries are dead. Man. It's a demon. All right. Uh, let's go and uh, refill our batteries, I guess. Might as well just do it for everything. Come on. Go up the rocks, please. There you go. I feel like I can't just leave. Uh, I can't just leave pieces of uh, equipment here anymore because if the ghost is going to drain, not drain, drain my batteries. If it's going to attack me and then make it so that I uh, I don't know how much. I'll just go ahead and pop another battery in here. Um, Sorry, if it's gonna, if the ghost is gonna attack me and then make me forget evidence, like I kind of need all of it to be there. Probably should have just left some. Where am I going? I gotta go this way. Uh, I probably should have just left my equipment down there, so that it was accessible. I kind of the reason is I just wanted to try to get the paramic, uh, because it might be easier to get the audio, but I, I will probably hopefully be fine. Alright, here come the eardrum shattering. Okay. Here we are. Back in the cave. So it's here. Let's try to do an EVP. Is there anyone here who would like to speak with me? Is there anyone here who would like to speak with me? Can you tell me your name? Can you tell me your name? Do you know why I'm here? Do you know why I'm here? Wow, 
That sounded like a response. That is very interesting. Why are you here? Why are you here? Is this your home? Is this your home? Sorry, I'm sprinting around this cave, but I'm not going to take my sprint off when it can chase me down like that. Is this your home? Is this your home? Wow, that sounded like a response. That is very interesting. Is it speaking Greek? How many people are here other than me? How many people are here other than me? <sighs> what? Just <laughs> huh? What just happened? Did it just like attack me without warning? Oh, that's the worst game of tag ever. What are you talking about? There was no ghost model to run from. I'm so confused. Can it just do that? It took my EMF data. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Alright, my EMF is also now dead. That is intensely frustrating. But I guess that's demons for you, you know? They don't always... Come on, let me go up the rocks, please. Thank you. Alright. Here we go. I... I just... Uh, I don't mind that you need to run away from it, and if it catches you, it's a problem, but, like, I don't even know what, like, that I didn't even know it was there. It just, I think it just materialized on top of me and immediately knocked me out and took my evidence, which is kind of, uh, not great. I don't like that. There we go. All right, let's try this again. And it took both stages of the EMF too, which is bummer.
These lights are acting funny. I should continue investigating. The EMF meter should not behave this way. This is paranormal. Is there anyone here who would like to speak with me? Is there anyone here who would like to speak with me? Is there anything you'd like to tell me? Is there anything you'd like to tell me? How many people are here other than me? How many people are here other than me? Wow, that sounded like a response. That is very interesting. Do you like the current family living here? That makes no sense. Do you like the current family living here? Is there anything you'd like to tell me? Is there anything you'd like to tell me? Yeah, I feel like we're due for like a manifestation pretty soon. Right? Oh, nope. Run. Now. Stay just out of her range over here. Yeah, it's very like Greek inspired. Very cool. Uh oh. Uh oh. Nope. Run. That was a very unusual voice. I'll keep that as evidence. Did it stop chasing me? Ooh, that is eerie audio evidence. I have no idea what it's recording. I'll keep that as audio evidence. What is it picking up? It's just picking up everything. Weird. Like, what did it just get there? Wow, that's great audio evidence. That was definitely something I could have picked up if it should have lasted more than a second. Wow, that's great audio evidence. Because it definitely like started sounding like it was playing an audio clip and then it just stopped. It's not great.
Can you speak, please? I'll keep that as audio evidence. What are you keeping as audio evidence? The dripping of the cave's water? Oh, God. Is it, it just can't, it, can it not leave the cave? I don't want to assume that that's the case, because it'll kill me. She does seem to kind of get stopped at this line here. Okay, we're going to do an EVP here. Is there anyone here who would like to speak with me? Is there anyone here who would like to speak with me? Wow, that sounded like a response. That is very interesting. Is there anything you'd like to tell me? Is there anything you'd like to tell me? Do you know why I'm here? Do you know why I'm here? Is this your home? Is this your home? Why are you here? I think I've already gotten this one. An answer to this one. Why are you here?
No, no. No, 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 no. Scared the crap out of me. He's like all of a sudden just right there. Okay, let's do EVP. Is there anything you'd like to tell me? Is there anything you'd like to tell me? Do you know why I'm here? Do you know why I'm here? Is this your home? Is this your home? Is there anything you'd like to tell me? Is there anything you'd like to tell me? Wow, that sounded like a response. That is very interesting. Do you know why I'm here? Do you know why I'm here? Got a lot of EBPs. Is this your home? Wondering if the rest of the audio is ambient. Is this your home? All right, where are you? I know you got to manifest soon. Nice. Wow, that's great audio evidence.
I hear it. There she is. Okay. Yeah, it's like she like bends over and like on all fours and then a water fountain or something comes out of her back, like super glowy. It looks really cool. I just wonder what kind of demon this is. Is it like basically a siren? Wow, that's great audio evidence. I still don't know what it's picking up, honestly. Do you know why I'm here? Do you know why I'm here? Is this your home? Is this your home? It, it already gave me a response to the name one, right? I think. Can you tell me your name? Can you tell me your name? Do you know why I'm here? Do you know why I'm here? Is this your home? Is this your home? Can you tell me your name? Can you tell me your name? Oh. Wow, that sounded like a response. That is very interesting. All right, we did it. That's 100%. We got her on the first, well, I guess second try, right? Because we had to go back and come back. But, like, we got her. I'm going to go back to the, uh, the office and see... Um, First off, if we have enough money to buy the auto cam, which would be amazing. I would love that for future investigations. Um, it's a little late in the game, uh, and it would have been very helpful prior to this, but that's okay. Um, as long as we can get it now, that'd be great. And then also uh, to listen to the e the EVPs that we got, because I think that most of them, are, or all of them, are probably in a different language. Alright, let's go. 
Nice. Perfect investigation. Nice. Oh no, copyright. All right. Uh, all right, let's take a look at this. Let's see first, let's go to see if we can get the auto cam. Wait, no, oh, so, like one more full investigation off from being able to buy it. One day, one day we'll get there. Um, all right, let's take a look. What is this ghost? It's called a Rizalka. Oh, that's probably really loud. I'm going to look up what a Rizalka is, because I think that is actually a type of ghost. I've heard it before. Um, oh, it's Slavic. Okay. So a Rizalka, in Slavic folklore, the Rizalka... Um, is typically a feminine entity, often malicious toward mankind and frequently associated with water, with counterparts in other parts of Europe, such as the French uh, Melusine and Germanic Nixie. Folklorists have proposed a variety of origins for the entity, including uh, that they may have originally stemmed from Slavic paganism, where they may have been seen as benevolent spirits. Rizalkai... I guess that's the plural of Rizalka, appear in a variety of media in modern popular culture. Um, let's see. Yeah, I mean, uh, seems to be uh, pretty accurate to the, the lore there. <laughs> ah, so yeah, it's definitely not Greek. Um, it was just hard to hear inside the cave. <laughs> so that's speaking like Cyrillic? Or I guess it's... Uh, so, yeah, it's gotta be Cyrillic, right? Or is that just the written language? Why does it go to track 6, 7, 8, 9, 10? Wait, are there more tracks that I didn't get? Oh, that's a bummer. Facho, amiga mea. So that was the, part, the answer to the question. Is there anyone here who would like to speak with me? I wish I spoke this language so that I knew what it was saying. <laughs> wow not only was that extremely loud but also um i didn't hear that actually play in the game so maybe it was bugged and we didn't actually get to hear it or it was just the first part of it because there was audio that just kept stopping for no reason so um okay that would have been really creepy to hear in in the in the cave when i was just hanging out um but yeah okay well that was uh the Rizalka. i hope you guys have enjoyed watching it's a lot of fun um for me I, I love it when they add new ghosts to this game it's it's really cool um i guess if what people are saying is true then we're looking forward to three more of them uh which should be very cool probably added throughout the maps because there have been a lot of locations that have had like locked basements and stuff like that that just we didn't have access to so maybe they'll be added there um who knows but it, it should be a lot of fun um and eventually once once we do actually get all the ghosts investigated and all of the releasing rituals are put into the game then uh, i am 100 percent going to go back and uh clear out each and every single location i'll make a video for each location as we clear out each spirit and it should be a lot of fun so uh yeah 
cool thanks for watching guys thank you for staying tuned as always and i will catch you guys in the next one don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you aren't yet subscribed i know it doesn't seem like much um but it does actually greatly help out so i i totally appreciate it um but anyway catch you later bye